I got to a point where I gained so much weight that I looked at myself in the mirror and I was like, Is that me? Is that me? <laughs> it's Hughesy in the building. Sit down, relax, baby, let me take you on a ride. Sit down, relax, baby, let me take you on a ride. Yeah, yeah. Welcome to my roller coaster. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it's your first time here, thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Tipo Sami. Sami, if you'd like. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys. <laughs> Honestly, I'm, I'm proud of myself. Okay, I'm proud of myself. I'm going to be sharing with you guys how I lost my belly fat in two weeks. You guys, 14 days. I know it sounds unbelievable, but I did it. Okay, so I did the Chloe Ting app challenge. If you guys don't know who Chloe Ting is, Chloe Ting is a fitness YouTuber who puts out content about home workout type of videos. She has many different programs, some short term, some long term that can help you get your body in shape. Okay, she has a website. I'm probably going to leave her website somewhere here on the screen. But yeah, she has a very, she's a very popular She's a very popular fitness YouTuber and this current challenge has been trending on YouTube and I was like, let me hop onto this bandwagon, okay? So just a little backstory, just a little backstory. I am not someone who struggles with like my weight or has body issues or anything like that. Not really, I've always been okay with my body, but because of the quarantine, okay? lockdown miss rona did us bad okay because of the lockdown i just gained so much weight okay i gained so so much weight so for those of you who may not know those of you that are new to my channel i live in china and the lockdown here was real you guys we were not allowed to go even just outside to take a walk so i was indoors for over two months just eating sleeping repeating and when i say i was eating guys i was eating okay i was eating because i'm stressed i'm eating because i'm bored i'm eating because i was i was just eating okay and i got to a point where i gained so much weight that i looked at myself in the mirror and i was like is that me is that me <laughs> that's me yeah no that's not so I honestly was like I need to do something like I need to do something about this because <laughs> then I even like wanted to take pictures and all that but my body was just not you know so when I saw this challenge I was like I have to do this I have to and I'm really so happy with my results so I'm gonna be sharing with you guys I was documenting each and every day from day 1 to day 14 <laughs> I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how it went and at the end of the video I'm gonna show you guys my results as well as share some tips with you guys of the other things that I did to achieve the results that I achieved I didn't just work out the other things I did we're gonna get into that at the end of the video but before we get into this video you guys know the drill if you're new to my channel please make sure you subscribe you guys it's free okay it's free to subscribe to your girl support your girl okay I'm almost at 10k so <laughs> support your girl click the little red button somewhere there subscribe make sure you also click the little bell right next so that you get a notification every time i post so without further ado let's get right into the video so this is how my body was looking before i started this challenge you guys i was high key looking pregnant okay pregnant ha! i posted we hear of this i was looking pregnant if my mother saw me she would send me back to africa shim <laughs> I was really looking so yeah and I had so much belly fat I was weighing 66.25 kgs which is guys anyway so this was day one yeah day one was the worst you guys when I say the worst I mean I could not even get through a workout without taking a rest I like literally two sets two stretches i was i was dead okay it was just so hard i was out of breath i was definitely not fit at all like it was horrible i i struggled on day one ah, i can't do this ah. you guys Part of the rules of this workout is you shouldn't take a break, but I can't. I can't. Uh -uh. Taking a five minute break. I can't. 
with you guys today is day just day two and I could not sleep like my whole this area is just sore my core me trying to sound all fit and anyway my whole body is so like especially this part and I, I don't know how I'm gonna do it today but day two let's go day two three and four were also really hard my body was in pain I still could not finish any of the sets but you know what I still soldiered on okay I just told myself I have to do this and yeah by day five I got the hang of things and my body got used to the workouts I actually started to enjoy Hey you guys, so I'm checking in. Today is day seven. I thought I'll check in and talk about my progress. So yeah, today is day seven, and what I'll say is it's much easier now you guys first day was a struggle I don't want to lie I was struggling but it's definitely much much easier now in fact sometimes I feel like the exercises aren't that intense anymore yeah so I'm thinking of working out twice a day that's in the morning and in the evening because this is a 10 minute workout so if I can do 10 minutes in the morning 10 minutes in the evening I think my results will be better. Let me show you guys what my tummy looks like now. I know y'all can see that. I know. And this is me breathing out. This is me breathing in. Ah, I'm so happy. So this is me on day 7 you guys. I feel like this is a lot of progress. And I'm sure you guys can see the definition. Yeah, of course I still have all this fat like I still have some fat but it's definitely better than what it was like on day one yes so I'm so excited I'm gonna carry on okay day 14 these results should be much better from day 8 it was a cruise you guys I actually looked forward to working out I was enjoying this okay which is quite strange for a lazy bum like me but yeah and I was working out twice a day I was also eating right you guys I wasn't skipping any meals but we'll get into the details of all the other extra things I did at the end of this video Today is day 14 I'm so proud of myself for being consistent okay and I'm very happy with what I'm seeing I'm so glad I did this challenge but let me work out let me do my day 14 workout and then I'll show you guys the results I'm gonna show you guys the results now. Drum roll! Two. 
And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the result of hard work, consistency, determination, and the grace of God. <laughs> you guys, my body was popping. Okay, stomach who? Stomach where? Love handles, what's that? <laughs> My confidence was back on fleek, okay? I am so happy with these results. And I now weigh 63.05 kgs, meaning I lost a total of 3.2 kgs. So these are my results, you guys. My body is back on fleek. But then it's important to note that obviously I still have some fat. It's not as much as it was at the beginning, but it's still there, okay? I still have more work to do. Two weeks is not enough time to burn all your fat, okay? And you also need to understand that our bodies are different. Some bodies respond faster, others respond slower, but my body responded faster. Like, my stomach is back in shape now, even though I'm going to continue working out. I need that six pack, okay? <laughs> anyway, we're gonna discuss what I ate during this challenge i'm probably gonna make a separate video which i'm gonna link right up here about what i ate during the chloe Ting challenge but basically you guys i had to clean out my diet okay because if you want more efficient results you need to do the extra work you need to put in the extra work and what you also need to understand is belly fat is as a result of overeating therefore your body storing all those extra carbs all those all that fat in your middle section okay so what i did was i cleaned out my diet i stopped eating any refined foods i went brown so i was eating brown bread brown rice brown pasta nothing refined okay i did not drink any sugary drink or any juice of any sort okay so for these past two weeks all i've been drinking was my water okay i was drinking my water <laughs> Me and my water was best friends, okay? So not drink any alcohol, any sweet drinks, nothing. Okay, so I'm going to make a detailed video, which I said I'm gonna link up there, but I, I, I cleaned out my diet. I ate more fruits, I ate more vegetables, less carbs, no refined. Yes, make sure you guys subscribe, turn your post notifications on so you don't miss that video. And I also want to mention that in addition to this workout, as soon as our lockdown was lifted, because then I, I started this challenge after the lockdown was lifted, so I made sure to put in more cardio to burn fat. What that means is I took more time to walk, so every day I would find time to just walk. Like I wasn't running or jogging, or anything. I mean some, some days I would run or jog, but most of the times I'll just take a walk, maybe for like 2-3 kilometers and come back home. Just like walk, just to get my heart pumping, you know? Put in that cardio if you have a skipping rope you can just skip if you can't actually go out wherever you are if you're still in quarantine you can buy a skipping rope online and just like skip just put in some cardio i also want to mention that it's it's also important to have a support system i had one of my friends who was doing this challenge with me as well so we were on this we were in this together and he would encourage me like yo did you work out today did you you know it's, it's important to have like a strong support system make sure your friends and family are supportive and just motivate yourself like trust me once you start seeing those results you will naturally be motivated but it's also good to have like your family and friends pushing you you, you can be you can find a friend who you can do it with and you guys can be accountable to each other and yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope i have motivated someone to stop sitting around and actually start working okay and a big shout out to miss chloe ting like you're out here changing lives i mean <laughs> the confidence is on a hundred now like i'm gonna be wearing crop tops all summer <laughs> no shame if you haven't subscribed please please subscribe to my channel i'm going to be making more videos like this next i want to transform my booty okay so i'm going to take her hourglass figure challenge make sure you subscribe you guys i'm going to be making more content like this and also more content about healthy eating like i said i'm gonna leave the what i ate video up there so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll see you in my next one bye